What's up guys, I'm Danny, and thank you for checking out my channel, Blu-ray Dan. Guys, this is it. This is the video you have all been waiting for, aside from my complete collection video. Everybody has seen my pile of Blu-rays piling up in the background and getting larger and larger, and everybody's been asking when that Blu-ray update was going to take place. Well, the wait is no longer here? I think that's how, I think that's how they say it, yeah. Now the titles that I'm about to show you started right before Christmas came around, to now. This is going to be my biggest Blu-ray update by far. Probably my biggest one ever. I have 165 Blu-rays to show you and that's not including like the, the each individual movie within certain sets. There's regular movies, box sets, TV shows, steel books, digipacks, whatever you think is in there, it's in there. So without further ado, I'm going to get this started. I'm not even going to put them in any kind of order. No no order of Christmas or anything. I'm just I'm just going to go ahead and do it and I'm going to move along with this video. Hope you guys stay tuned and I hope you watch through the whole thing because towards the end you're going to see a hell of a lot of brand new releases and stuff like that probably just the way I have them stacked up. So here we go. Enjoy guys. The first Blu-ray I'm going to show you is Chucky the Complete Collection. This set has all six movies including Child's Play, Child's Play 2, Child's Play 3, Bride of Chucky, Seed of Chucky, and the newer Curse of Chucky. Next up we have Rigor Mortis, a comedy movie that I've loved for the longest time. I had to get this imported, Just Friends. Another set of movies that I had to get special ordered Police Academy, The Complete Collection, all seven movies. Police Academy, Police Academy 2, Their First Assignment. Police Academy 3, Back in Training. Police Academy 4, Citizens on Patrol. Police Academy 5, Assignment, Miami Beach. <sighs> Police Academy 6, City Under Siege. Police Academy 7, Mission to Moscow. Awesome set. Dracula Untold, Predestination. 101 Dalmatians, 101 Dalmatians 2, Patches London Adventure. Bronson, Gotta Love Tom Hardy. Immortals. The Right, pretty good movie too. You guys haven't seen this one, check this out. Dolphin Tale. Next up I have Misfits, The Complete Collection. This is seasons one, two, three, four, and five. Another set that I had to get ordered from out of country just because it wasn't released here. And luckily it plays on my Xbox, so super excited for that. Next up I have Nightcrawler. Really, really good movie. Jake Gyllenhaal did a bang up job with this film. The Quiet Ones, Blood Ties, Under the Skin, Winter's Tale, Justice League, Throne of Atlantis, Life of Crime, Blended, which I know a lot of people say they didn't like. I haven't seen it yet, but I've heard some good things. My brother loved it, and I'm a huge fan of Adam Sandler, so don't tell me different, guys. X-Men The Last Stand with the slipcover. I believe this is the final X-Men movie that I needed with the slipcover, so that's finished. There you go. Here we got John Wick, another awesome, awesome movie. I mean, people were saying this is Keanu Reeves' comeback. I definitely agree. Really, really good film. Action scenes were awesome. The colors in the movie were really cool. It's almost like they were another character within the film. You could see it on the back. And on the front, neon colors, really good movie. If you haven't seen this one, check it out. Next up we have If I Stay, Rio 2, The Book of Life, The Giver, Sin City, A Dame to Kill For, X-Men Origins Wolverine with the slipcover. So it looks like I was wrong here, guys. This was the last one <laughs> that I needed to get with the slipcover, so now we're done. Swelter, Once Upon a Time in Shanghai, The Pirates, White-Haired Witch, Let's Kill Ward's Wife. This one's a pretty good dark comedy movie. Definitely check this one out. Brotherhood of Blades, A Company Man, My Way, and While We Were Here, The Courier, Dino King 3D, Drug War. Really beautiful slipcover, so I had to hunt it down and, uh, and buy it, unfortunately, but it is gorgeous, so definitely worth it. Badges of Fury, Mechanic, Ip Man Final Fight, The Lookalike, Kid Cannabis, Traffickers, another really good film, definitely check this one out. Zombie Hunter, what are you going to do? Cavemen, The Frontline. Guys, I cannot recommend this movie enough. I'm telling you, in my honest opinion, it is one of the best war films that I've seen. Um, not the best, I'd say Saving Private Ryan is one of my favorites. Um, it, Saving Private Ryan is my favorite. This one right here comes very close. I highly, highly, highly recommend this one. Iceman, Child of God. Next we have The Zero Theorem, and we have The Theory of Everything, awesome movie. St. Vincent, another awesome movie. Whiplash, <laughs> guys, first of all I got the slipcover. Second of all, my number one movie of 2014. I haven't seen a movie this good in a long time, so it's not just, 
it's not just my number one movie of 2014. It's my number one in, in quite some time. Really, really good film. If you have not seen it, check this out. J.K. Simmons completely deserved the Oscar that he got. Big Hero 6, Sons of Anarchy, the complete seventh season, the final season. And this is the Target exclusive. Kill the Messenger, The Interview, The Homesman, Dumb and Dumber 2, Birdman with the really, really cool open up slipcover, and the really awesome red case. You guys can see it right there. Birdman. Next up, we have Enemy uh, with the slipcover. I had to get this from Amazon Canada. Troll Hunter with the slipcover. I had to order this from eBay. Deliver Us from Evil, The Judge, Parental Guidance, Jersey Boys, a Medea Christmas, the awesome, awesome Best Buy Steelbook Taxi Driver. Look at that artwork, it's gorgeous. This one I actually got from Tish, The Last Action Hero. The beautiful, beautiful Red Scarface Steelbook. I got this one off of a member on Blu-ray.com for $6. Gorgeous, what a steal. The Thing, the original version. The Digibook of Midnight Express. Planes, Trains, and Automobiles. Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. Now, see, the funny thing about this one is that it didn't come with the actual slip for this cover. We got this from Target. I got this for Christmas. I got this from Target. It came with the individual slip covers for Donatello, Michelangelo, Leonardo, and Raphael, but it did not come with the actual slip cover itself. But I just ordered it from Chad, aka WrestleManiac1130, so that should be here soon. Um, yeah, I wish I had it for this video, but what are you gonna do? So I'm still getting it. Ninja Turtles. Next up, we got 22 Jump Street, Into the Storm, Guardians of the Galaxy, Awesome movie. Dawn of the Planet of the Apes. Awesome, awesome movie. Earth to Echo. We have Hell on Wheels, the complete third season. True Detective, the complete first season. Boardwalk Empire, the complete third season. And Boardwalk Empire, the complete fourth season. Next up, we have Kindergarten Cop. The Starship Troopers trilogy, including Starship Troopers, Starship Troopers 2, Hero of the Federation, and Starship Troopers 3, Marauder. The Expendables 3. The Crazies, The Guillotines, Dexter the Complete Seventh Season, Little Big Soldier, 1911 Revolution, Apollo 13, Little Fockers, gotta love it, huh? Little bit? Little Fockers, huh? Yep. This movie, I'm in it. The Narrow. Okay, I'm sorry. Back to 1942 with a very, very rattly disc. War of the Arrows, Assault Girls, The Thieves, Not Suitable for Children, Oka! Bedeviled, which Jay from Absolute Sublime talks about all the time. He says it in like every other video. He says that this movie is awesome, so I had to pick it up. If by some chance you're not subscribed to him, definitely subscribe. His link will be down below. Blade of Kings, Legend of the Fist, The Four, Nightfall, Flashpoint, The Out of Print, Wrong Turn 6, The Polar Express 3D with the awesome, awesome lenticular slipcover. Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles 3D with that awesome slipcover. Um, I got it really, really banged up, so I believe I ordered a replacement uh, from Chad, actually. Again, WrestleManiac 1130. Guys, if you are not subscribed to him, you gotta subscribe. The Skeleton Twins, Tammy. The Toho Godzilla Collection, which includes Godzilla Tokyo SOS and Godzilla Final Wars. Stalingrad, The Flintstones, The Breakup. Hellboy 2, The Golden Army, again with that awesome slipcover. Wow, that looks really good in the video, too. Damn. <laughs> Hellboy. Santa Paws 2. And the Bruce Lee collection, which includes The Big Boss, Fist of Fury, The Way of the Dragon, and Game of Death. Gotta love Bruce Lee. Next up, I have the double feature of Short Circuit and Short Circuit 2. Inside Lewin Davis. Deck the Halls. American Gangster. Surviving Christmas. Boyhood. The Guest. Locke which again, another Tom Hardy movie, he's the man. Tusk, The Equalizer, which was actually really good. We got The Steelbook of Lawless, awesome, awesome artwork. Check that out, glossy finish, really, really like it. Again, guys, Tom Hardy, I can't say it enough. Also, Shia LaBeouf, huge fan of him. Check him out, check this guy out, check this movie out, Steelbook. <laughs> we are nearing the end, guys and gals. I just thought I'd let you know. I don't know how I've blown through so many so fast. It's gonna be probably one of my longest videos, but Let's continue. Next up we have The Girl with the Dragon Tattoo. This is Where I Leave You. No Good Deed. Upside Down, which uh, I believe comes with the 3D version. Yep, that's why the big 3D word is up there. <laughs> Let's continue. A Walk Among the Tombstones. This is a pretty good movie. 
Maze Runner. This one's actually not that bad either. This one surprised me actually. 30 Days of Night, Dark Days. Love the first one, haven't seen this. I know it, uh, complete change in actors and everything. I just, I love the first one, had to check it out. Honeymooners, the classic 39 episodes. So happy to have this on Blu-ray. It looks really, really, a world of difference on Blu-ray, really does. This could quite possibly be, you know, it, yeah, this, this is, uh, this could very well be my favorite TV show of all time. Never fails to put me in a good mood, never fails to make me laugh. If you guys haven't seen the Honeymooners, you don't know what you're missing. Next we have Get On Up, A Most Wanted Man, Sex Tape, Automata with the beautiful lenticular subcover, The Box Trolls, Lucy, which I actually enjoyed, I know a lot of people didn't like it, but I enjoyed it, The Lucy Steelbook, Fury, really love this movie, The Fury Steelbook, <laughs> The Grand Budapest Hotel, Gone Girl, Bad Words, Horns, Mr. Peabody and Sherman, Next up, guys, we have Cody Ritchie's favorite, favorite movie of 2014. If, you, if you're not subscribed to him, definitely check this out. Um, he's going to kill me for saying that because he hated this movie. It's probably his least favorite movie of all time. Um, <laughs> A Million Ways to Die in the West. As Above, So Below. The Drop. <laughs> Tom Hardy. The comic book steelbook of King Kong. And the comic book steelbook of Jurassic Park. Unleashed. The Book of Eli. 300. Doom. As the Light Goes Out. And last but not least, Reach Me. Now, I know this isn't the best movie to end with, but I am a huge Stallone fan, so I feel pretty content with this uh, finale right here. Reach Me on Blu-ray. All right, guys, I could barely breathe. That took not as long as I thought it was gonna take. I'm just glad that now I can clean up my room, I can move stuff off the dresser, I can move things out of here now. This is a video that I've been wanting to film for quite some time now, so I'm so glad I got to do it. I hope you guys are still with me. I really do. Maybe you skim to the end. I really hope not. I hope you guys watch it all. I mean, knowing me, I cut it down to like a minute and a half. You guys are awesome. Really, really, thank you so much for the support. Honestly, guys, I don't know if I've seen a bigger Blu-ray update than this. If anybody wants to compete with this 165 plus Blu-ray title update thing, you let me know. Because there definitely were 165 items, Blu-rays themselves, but there were a lot of them that had multiple movies in them, so I don't know. It definitely had to come close to 200. Just saying. Huh? Don't mess with me. A little bit. A little bit narrow. As always, I have a couple questions for you guys. First off, what did you think of this massive haul? Were there any titles within this haul that, that stuck out to you or or that you want to get? Do you have most of the titles? Am I nuts for doing this? You tell me. Or if you just have anything else to say or just want to leave a comment below, just do it, man. I'm here. <laughs> you know? Or girls. Anybody. Girl, you know, I'm, I'm not lonely. I have my Blu-rays. <laughs> Alright guys, let me finish this video. I'm delirious because it's currently 520 in the morning. I just filmed six videos including this one. I'm exhausted but for some reason wide awake. I'm just so happy that I finally got this video out here for you guys. Thank you so so much for watching. I truly truly appreciate it. As always guys, if you could do me a favor and hit that like button and give me a thumbs up. Please leave a comment down below in the comment box below. And as always, hit that subscribe button because I have a lot of more videos coming up. I don't know how many more 165 title Blu-ray updates are going to be but but I hope you guys enjoyed this one regardless. But there's still tons more videos to come. And as I always say, guys, thank you. I love and appreciate every single one of you. Thank you for your continued support. I don't think you guys realize how much it means to me. Um, if you sat through this, then you're, you're a damn Blu-ray Danner. That's what we're calling you now. Blu-ray Danners for life. All right. Like I said, it's 520 in the morning. So before I say any other weird things like Blu-ray Danner, let me finish this video. Thanks for everything, guys. I'm Danny, and this is the Blu-ray Dan channel. See you guys next time.